So hello Brody, you're calling from sunny Australia? Um, it's evening your time, isn't it? So thanks for allowing this. So just to recap, uh, you're, may, you're 21 years old, your main diet is bread. You have some plain pasta with tomato sauce, yeah? Uh, so bread with Nutella, Vegemite, and uh, you eat potatoes, carrots and sausages, and that's about it. Um, you mentioned that, yeah, that's it, yeah? Um, you mentioned that this According to your parents, it started from about two, three years old for no obvious reason, nothing that nobody can, can recall, yeah? Okay, and you mentioned very nervous about the food you got prepared for the end of session. So right now, if I were to ask you to eat some of the food now, what would your response be, would you say? You know, go ahead and try this and try that. You'd say, oh, I can't, yeah? Yeah, yeah, there's no way. It just wouldn't happen. Okay, so if at the end of the session you're feeling very differently about it, obviously something's changed, yeah? Okay. Brilliant. So thank you for this and let's see how we get on. Yes, I am technologically not as savvy as... Okay, so we're filming. <laughs> so welcome back, bro. We just finished our session and you've just gone the first thing out of the fridge behind you, which is some grapes, I believe, yeah? Uh, seedless grapes, I expect. So when you're ready. Oh, no. <laughs> I think everything is seedless nowadays. Yeah. Not bad, huh? What do you think? Nice. Pretty good. Okay. Awesome. So you can definitely eat grapes again, right? You can add them to your repertoire. Awesome. Good. Weird, isn't it? Yeah, what, what's weird? Well, just pop them in and ate them. Off you go. I know. People say that a lot. It's weird. Because remember, the, end of the start of the session, so there's no way I can eat this. No way. And just pop that in your mouth. Isn't that cool? Yeah. So you definitely enjoy grapes. <laughs> the real thing, yeah, you know the problem with supermarkets is that strawberry-like substance, strawberry-flavored. Well, it's not strawberry though; it's not the same, you know. The real thing, yeah, food-like substances. So, um, grapes are a winner. Awesome, absolute winner. Great. And when you're ready, you can try something else. Maybe that's a winner. Oh, <laughs> okay, I'll put it on pause. We are rolling again. So, what do we have now? Okay, go, go for it. <laughs> yeah, sometimes the packaging is a new experience as well. You just bite, yeah, you just bite the nice banana, kind of sweet. Nice, huh? Yeah. They're nice, yeah. Yeah, strawberries statistically are quite a winner as well. So it's a good start. Yeah. Excellent. It's good. Awesome. So we have grapes and strawberries to add to your new list of things we're going to eat. You say without any effort. So, oh, I'm going to force myself to eat strawberries. You like them. There's no effort. Just go for it. Right. Take your time so you could eat those again for sure so you know eat, eat as many as things as you want to know for sure you know something's changed now you know yeah that's good i bet your mum's uh because you're in australia your mum's in england and she's probably you know waiting biting her nails saying i hope it worked it's gonna happen <laughs> you can say oh no mum you know it didn't really work and then you just sit there eating strawberries in front of her it's quite fun you know the strawberries <laughs> yeah, I'm finding it hard now because strawberries are beginning to be out of season, so they, they get these things imported that are not very juicy. So this is the problem with winter. But hopefully you've got nice ones. Outside of the world, you, you actually get sun. Yeah, we've, we've got endless rain. Any uh, any uh, any other foods you got there? Try. Okay, sure. With uh, with a bit of milk, yeah. Okay. Okay. So um, you just put a little bit of cornflakes in the bowl, which is gonna pour a little bit of cereal, just kind of enough to cover the cereal, with just a bit less than that. Yeah. And again, milk is a new thing as well. Yeah. So. 
accident. Now, some people sprinkle something like cinnamon or a little bit of sugar on it or something, you know. Um, okay, so, well, no, that's good. I mean, I, you know, I prefer without sugar, obviously, because, you know, it's not good for you. But, you know, even plain, they're okay. Um, so when you're ready, just, you know, I don't know if they're the tastiest thing in the world, because they're a bit bland, but they're okay. You can eat them. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> they are bland, don't they? Yeah. yeah. And then you, you you know you can you can explore and find something a bit more funky, has a little piece of fruit in it or something, or little coconut clusters or something. Yeah. Mm. I know, I know. So you you may you know if you've got some some fellow students or something, you go with them and say, you know, what do you do? Oh, try this, it's really nice. So, you know, you gotta Go to shop with some friends, yeah. But it's something that you know you're eating and checking it out. It's not the most amazing thing, but no problem. Cool. So it's another thing plus a combo. So um, you know you can eat that. Anything else you got there? So I don't want to you know rush you. I just you know want you to just know you can eat all these things. Oh, did you? <laughs> So you you could just eat the, the bolognese sauce if you wanted to, yeah? Okay. Sure. That's sweet, I like that, yeah. You just said, you know, you came from the supermarket with a real bag of, a big bag of food. You said, oh, I'm, I like shopping like a real person, yeah? It's true, yeah, now you feel like, oh, this is what people do. They go, and when they buy stuff, they buy a range of stuff, yeah? Not just bread, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you've got the bolognese sauce. Cut. And of course, yeah, I can't, I can't be there with you to taste it. But if you follow the instructions, it should be okay. Sure. My little thing is in the way. Get my. You can even have that on toast, you know, the bolognese sauce sometimes. If we make extra, you know, day, next day, just put on a bit of toast. It's all right, yeah? It's okay, cool. And you'll tweak it as you wish, you know, to, to suit. Right. Well, there's a lot going on in that, isn't there? There's a lot of ingredients. And the texture is different and everything, so it's a good one. But again, if you can eat that, you can eat anything because, you know, your system's getting used to it. And once it gets used to the, you, the newness of it, then it just realizes, okay, it is new. It is a bit strange, but it's not bad. But I like it. Yeah? So very good. So I don't know if you've got any other food you want to try around. Well, you can do it in your own time, but I think you've proven your point. Yeah, Excellent. So awesome work today and now this is a absolute categorical change from the beginning when you said there's no way i could try this now you're eating it you even liked most of the stuff yeah that was stuff was okay so thank you for this uh Brody, this really helps inspire other people and uh great well done awesome work okay thanks <laughs>